All right, guys. So we're quickly looking at the periodic limb disorder. All right, periodic limb disorder. Okay, periodic limb movement disorder. So this periodic limb movement disorder is more of like you are slipping somebody, so all of a sudden they are pushing you with their legs and all of that. All right. So it's actually a sleep disorder characterized by repetitive or involuntary movement of your limbs. Okay, most especially your legs. All right, that's after you have um, slept, right? All right, so um, we said that it's a sleep disorder, car, okay? So the movement typically um, occurs every 20 to 40 seconds and can actually disrupt higher sleeping. Can be sleeping and waking up, sleeping and waking up. So there's involuntary limb movement, usually in the lower extremities, all right? Um, sleep disruption, so you can actually be sleeping and be waking up, right? So daytime sleepiness, too, all right? So causes is the exact cause is not really known, but it's associated with other medical conditions, okay? Like restless leg syndrome, medical conditions, like you have diabetes, iron deficiency, spinal cord injuries, sleep apnea, some certain medications, right? So neurological disorders like Parkinson's disease, narcolepsy, all of these could actually uh, be linked to that. Okay. So diagnosis is typically involves for the sleep study, that's polysomnography, to monitor your limb movements and sleep patterns. All right. Then treatment is dopaminic, uh, dopaminergic agents, benzodiazepines, anti-schizal medications just to reduce the limb movements. Okay. The lifestyle changes like good sleep hygiene, regular exercise, avoid caffeine or alcohols before bedtime. All of this could actually improve the symptoms. Okay. So that's it for periodic limb movement disorder.